A British cleric created a stir recently by accusing Jesus of supposedly teaching something wrong. Jesus told us that when we pray, we should say, Our Father. But the Archbishop of York told his fellow clergymen, quote, I know the word Father is problematic for those whose experience of earthly fathers has been destructive and abusive. And for all of us who have labored rather too much from an oppressively patriarchal grip, on life, end quote. For a Christian leader to so disregard God's self-revelation in the scriptures in which God presents himself as father and uses masculine pronouns is quite arrogant in my humble opinion. But what about the issue he raises as to dads? Are fathers part of the problem of society or a major part of the solution? Well, here are some startling statistics from NoLongerFatherless.org. 85% of youths in prison come from fatherless homes. 71% of high school dropouts come from fatherless homes. 90% of all homeless and runaway children come from fatherless homes. 60% of youth suicides come from fatherless homes. In short, we don't need less fathers, we need more fathers, and to stay in the home. Contrary to what some Church of England officials say, we need to strengthen our view of the Father, including our Heavenly Father, and not to continue to emasculate it to our society's detriment. For D. James Kennedy Ministries, I'm Jerry Newcomb.